Now we turn to the other side of this story, that violent high-speed chase that ended in a crash involving four vehicles. Skycam 6 flew over the scene at 56th Street and Northfield Drive in Hendricks County. RTV6 reporter Derek Thomas continues our live team coverage tonight in Brownsburg. Derek. Todd, right now the uh, debris and wrecked vehicles have been carried away, but at 1130 this morning, this was a major crash site. The chase came to a crashing conclusion just west of the intersection of 56 and Northfield Drive. The suspects were traveling in this blue Explorer at an extremely high rate of speed westbound on 56th Street. How fast were they going? How frightening was it as, as a motorist on the road while this well, was happening? Well, as a motorist, it was scary to me. It's something like you only see on TV. But this was real life. Rescue personnel attempted to sort out what happened. When we arrived on the scene, we had three vehicles involved. Um, one was a blue SUV that was on fire. There was also a red vehicle that appears to have been injured or damaged in the front of the vehicle as well as the rear. And then we had a uh, Honda Pilot that was also involved. The two people in the Honda Pilot were not injured. The two people in the red Cadillac sustained the most serious injuries and were taken to St. Vincent Hospital. The suspects, including the one here that you can see from Skycam 6, were taken to Wishard Hospital. I think this pursuit was well within our policy and it was necessary. We hate the way that it ended in a car crash. And thank God nobody was seriously injured. Um, but uh, we think our officers did a great job during the pursuit. Now, the suspects did pitch the a uh, handgun in Eagle Creek as they were driving down 56th Street. Police did cover that weapon. Live from Brownsburg, Derek Thomas, RTV6.